agricultural experts have called for the incorporation of artificial intelligence and relevant technological advancement into agricultural methods to boost production and enhance food security. The call was made during a bi-monthly general meeting of the Nigerian Institution of Agricultural Engineers, Abuja chapter, which has held on Wednesday in Abuja, the nation's capital. Let's now join Clairview's Gloria Atta for details. Food security has become one of the most pressing issues on the agenda of most countries of the world especially in developing countries like Nigeria that is currently grappling with a high prevalence of chronic undernourishment and hunger, which stands at a staggering 22 million, according to the World Food and Agricultural Organization. According to research, about 84 million Nigerians live below the poverty line despite the abundance of rich and arable land and an array of crops for farming activities. According to experts, achieving food security will remain a dream for the country unless it embraces emerging technologies and innovations in agriculture to facilitate the transformation required in the sector. Speaking at its bi-monthly general meeting in Abuja, the chairman, NIAE Abuja chapter, engineer Adebayo Adedeji, and the president, African University of Science and Technology, Professor Peter Onwalu, emphasize the importance of integrating AI and technology to address contemporary agricultural challenges and improve agricultural practices in the country. Technology is the in thing. What we've been doing with agriculture is whole farming. Most of our aged farmers, they've left. Nobody is nobody's taking over what they are doing because farming is hard work, it's drudgery, it's laborious, it's labor intensive. So if you want to encourage these uh, young ones to come in, you must find a way to introduce technology where you can sit in your tractor with air condition and the thing is working. You will see most of them will be attracted. Okay, for instance, take uh, Kaigbe village. Kaigbe village is about two hours away from the city center. What they have done in that village, there are about 30 communities in that village, in that environment. Kaigbe village is the only village that have solar uh, mini grid system. A village, I mean, just 20 kVA solar powered village and as we speak many of their uh, in, uh, children sons and daughters that are resident in Abuja they've gone back home because of that uh, you know that advantage of uh, energy so the issue of carrying your hoe and all stuff is, is already in the past in most of the advanced climb we don't know what is actually holding us back but we believe very strongly that Honestly, we are not where we used to be. And we believe, as an agricultural engineer, as a profession, that except we engineer our agriculture, Nigeria is going to nowhere. Because we need to attract these youthful hands to replace the aged ones in the village. And there's no way you can attract them with this old method of farming. It's not possible. My advice is that government should do more, especially in providing support. Agriculture is not particularly especially the <clears throat> production part of agriculture. Sometimes there are issues of um, weather, issues of um, what can happen, natural disasters, and so farmers need a lot of support. And government should do more <clears throat> to provide this support, especially in the area of inputs, technology, um, improved varieties, um, even um, um, money that is required to buy labor and so on. So all this support all over the world, even in developed economies, government has always supported agriculture. And so we should continue to do more uh, because it borders on even um, national security. If people are hungry, it is difficult to control them. And so we need to do more. And then finally, in the area of supporting research and development, and even when the research is done, taking those research to farmers uh, is also important. There are many people who like to do things even within the economy, but they lack knowledge, improved knowledge that will help them to do better. And so government should uh, do more in the area of... Uh, um, I, during the lecture, I talked about the extension system. We need to reinforce our national extension system, both at the national level and at sub-national levels, 
to make sure that farmers can have access to information, have access to knowledge that can help them to improve their productivity. The meeting also focused on emerging issues within the chapter, including the need to set up lucrative businesses to raise the necessary funds needed to manage its operations. Gloria Atta, reporting for Clevio News.